hello viewers a warm welcome to all my viewers so in today's video we will going to learn how to call web service without using oracle wallet and of course you calling https urls without even using oracle wallet um, first of all i believe so that we all know the difference between why do we need oracle well, uh, wallet or I should say when uh, we would be needing Oracle Wallet. Actually, to call the HTTPS URLs, we need Oracle Wallets. And because Oracle provides the wallets through the enter uh, only with Enterprise Edition, so I have created a workaround for that one to call the web service or the HTTPS URLs without using Oracle Wallet. So I have created a you can say list of items which we would be needing. We would be needing a batch file, database, Oracle database directories, Oracle database jobs, database procedures, util file procedure to call the club. Of course, the data which we would be getting, it would be stored in the club. And of course, we would be creating a table for that one. So without wasting further time, let's start it developing our you can say the tool or something whatever you want to say it okay so this is the data which we are going to fetch that one I have created a web service on apex.oracle.com it could be any one of them you can have the data from any of the site any of the portal I have just choose this one as an example you can see it is an HTTPS URL which is secure connection and now we would be creating tables for that for the same ones so let me delete all the other stuffs and we would be close others no I won't be needing anymore okay so let me clear this one so first of all creating a web server table okay now for your reference only i have created a database directory over here c underscore web c slash web service this is the path which i have provided i have created a database directory okay and of course i will of course create the job again okay so let me delete the older one Okay, the job has been deleted. So here I'm creating a new job. You can write down call underscore web service. Okay, this is my job main. I will use executable. Select the executable. I have choose final dot batch file. I have opened it, applied okay there is some i've already created this uh, call web services demo okay so hmm, that's great i have you already using call underscore demo and the name would be same call underscore web service underscore demo okay that's great so I'm just creating a procedure for that one so before starting all these jobs you can see there are two batch files I have created the reason behind the two creating a two batch file is in first batch file means the core one uh, it's final dot bat it's final dot batch file I have written all the code likewise if I am using WS script to create object this is the default script anyone in the uh, from the uh, who is having the windows can create the script and run it Microsoft provide all these features freely so you can uh, you simply use HTTP dot open and get command even you can call it the uh, call from the post ones and of course I am saving the final data in the final dot txt this is the same URL which I have called 
this one so, uh, so this send uh, HTTP dot send will send a request to this URL and get the response in case I don't get the response then of course I would get this error return to return no on download and all those stuffs would be occurred okay so f initially we will start uh, we will first call and of course let's not forget about the another uh, you can say batch file in this batch file I have just created a path over here to reach to my final dot bat the reason behind this is because Oracle doesn't uh, gets confused while calling the uh, batch file directly the final dot batch means if you are running whole code like this one so it get confused so rather than doing that one I'm just calling a batch file from a batch file okay so for, uh, first let us try it manually what it what will be happened so see it is it has called final dot back and final dot txt has been created so this is the whole data which was over here of our get uh, from our get web service we can see whole data over here okay so let us delete this one and try to call it from the database itself okay so we have created a table over here if you remember in the first step we have created a table now let's call this procedure first we would be calling this procedure the scheduler I should say this is the command from the for the scheduler which we have already created this one it is gbms underscore scheduler dot run job of course we have created a job so we simply run that one uh-huh it shows me an error yeah of course the name has been different one so let me check the name the actual name is call underscore web service underscore demo sorry I think so it was the earlier one which uh, when I was trying to call it so I think so this will work yeah it is successfully work. so let me check over here it is oh, oh it won't work because we have directly caught you can see why why it hasn't worked because in uh, I have directly called final dot batch file in the file which we have directly written the code it haven't created a text file which we are expecting okay so let's drop it okay and we will copy the name and we will open the connections and we will create a new job Okay, with the same name or different name any way you want so executable okay so we have to call this one call underscore web dot batch okay now we call this one and you can see the text file over here is created successfully now we will call another procedure which is simply calling this and inserting the data in this one you can see empty club and all those stuffs I have, I have just fetching the data and creating the log file into the B file sorry B file into the log, uh, log column okay so here you can you get all the data Please do let me know in my comments how do you like my video that's all for today and of course this is the whole video uh, many of the viewers are waiting for that one how to call a web service without using Oracle wallet and if you want any kind of help regarding this one I can provide you in the comments or share this whole data with you I don't have any problem in that one because it's a simple web service I have just provided the same data over here and I think so I can share all the things if you want so please do let me know in the comments 
and if you want a particular data that also I can provide you likewise if you want this batch file code or you can simply search on the Google and get this code it can be uh, you can able to get that uh, one more thing you uh, viewers I even in add add on to this what would happen uh, in some of the case where there is a basic authentications so there I have you, uh, I have struggled that uh, that one so I don't want you to struggle that one so in case you have basic authentications then of course your username comma password would come accordingly and this whole format whole procedure will go on a same go all right thank you please do let me know in my comments how do you like my video Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.